Hello, I'm Amber Uper, and this is a model kit review. Um, what some people call a uh, unboxing video. And this one is for the uh, it's, it's a 144 scale uh, kit for the Kawanishi Emily Type 2 Mark 12 Japanese Navy flying boat from World War II. And this uh, this is another big plane in a small scale. So, let's take a look at the box. Now this, this is an older kit, I think. I could be wrong, but this is, uh, this is, uh, LS. For, I don't really know who LS is. I don't know much about this kit. I believe this is a Japanese kit. But anyway, so there's the side box, or the box side with the art. And let's take a look here. There's the one of the ends. That's the bent end. There's the other end. Uh, if you can, I don't know. You probably can't see that with it on. And then here we go. And here's uh, some information about the Emily. So let's take a look at what's in the box. This has already been opened. To, I borrowed this from a friend to uh, do a kit review on it. So, let's take a look at what's in the box. And here's your, uh, here's your instructions. This is how they come. So let's, uh, let's unfold these and see what we get here. Alright. This shows you some of the uh, tail markings here, different uh, versions of the kit. Marking and painting. And let's see. Here's your parts up here, where to find them. And this apparently can be mounted with either bombs or torpedoes, depending on which one you choose. And we get into the uh, building the body. Now here's another one that has apparently has the, uh, um, the cockpit area with the seats. And more. The... Uh, Instructions here are not real detailed, but um, they seem to be uh, good enough to figure out what you have to do to put the thing together anyway. So, there's a, they even give you little guns to mount in the nose and the tail and the top turret. Interesting. There we go, putting the, uh, the wing floats on and the motors. Finishing up the, uh, you can put wheels on it if you choose to do so, because uh, apparently these had that option. So, yeah, yeah, fairly simple instructions, but, and here's your decals. They seem to be okay. They don't look all ratty and um, cracked or anything like that. They look like they're still good. So there's that. So let's take a look at what's in the box. All right, now, here's one set of wings. I'm not sure if this is the upper or lower. Here's the other set of wings. One of these is one of these is the upper and the other is the lower. It's interesting. They've got these things to. Uh, Where you put them into the body, it looks like they'll be uh, pretty, pretty well uh, supported in the body. So here's one of your uh, body halves. That's a big flying boat. And let's see, here's the clear parts. A nice set of uh, clear parts. What else we got? There's the other body half. Four motor cowlings, lots of little parts. I'm not sure what the parts are for, but I'm sure they're in the instructions. Yeah. You got wheels here if you want to put the landing gear on it. A pair of torpedoes and a pair of bombs. Okay, let's see. 
the tail wings and uh, the uh, vertical tail surface, and the, uh, the float halves. Do that. Put this over here. And your float halves, your tail surfaces. Here's your cockpit area with four seats. Which, if you really wanted to, you could put pilots in there because they, you can get um, 144 scale uh, pilot figures, generic pilot figures from uh, Shapeways, if you wish to do that. They're tiny, but um, yeah, they'd fit there. Let's see what else is in the box. Well, you get this little thing of glue, and then there's uh, four propellers in the box. They're uh, a little worse for wear, which is typical of the propellers when they're not uh, properly uh, protected for shipping. Because, you know, these things, the parts bounce around in the box and whatnot. So, that's, uh, that's what there is to this kit. Now, I don't know how good the uh, fit and finish will be on this kit, because I don't have any experience with these. But, I mean, it, it looks like they're okay. They, they look pretty good. Let's see here. If you look at that. It doesn't look like it'll be too difficult to put this together. It has It does have alignment pins and things like that. So, yeah, could be a good kit. Only one way to find out. I'll know after. I'll know after it gets put together. <laughs> I asked my friend about it, and, and I'll find out how good of a kit it was to put together. So there it is, the uh, Kawanishi Emily Type Two Mark Twelve Japanese Navy flying boat in one one forty four scale. Thanks for watching.